Bitcoin has seen the big breakout of our symmetrical triangle. And now in this video, I want to be telling you exactly what to be looking for next in terms of the ways that we can be trading this over the coming few days for the rest of this week. OK, but how this price action is going to be absolutely pivotal for the rest of the year. Why? Because we are coming up to such major targets which are coming into confluence with our Fibonacci, our higher term time frame levels, our naked pointer controls, the Elliott wave counts. This is this is just going to be absolutely massive. So I'm going to be preparing you for that in this video, giving you the explanations OK, and I will be talking about the still the fake out potential of this triangle. So uh, you need to be aware if you are not aware, you are not prepared. And you're if you how we say if you are not planned, your only plan is to fail. So I'm going to help you get ready for these big moves. My goal of 2024 is to assist as many of you as possible. I want to make Chart Champions the best, most recognized place for trading education and the, simply the best trading coaches in the world. So uh, yeah, I want to get you profitable. I want to get you crushing these charts and enjoying trading. So let's go with a big smile on our face with this together, the Bitcoin technical analysis of today. So yeah, of course, in the last video that I made just uh, 24 hours ago, we were trading within this triangle. OK, so I want to pick up from that. And within this triangle, as always, we have to even right now, we have to have a bullish scenario and a bearish scenario. Why? Because the market at the end of the day is a probabilistic outcome. There are no guarantees. So we must be planned for both scenarios, market action that can go down and up, right? But we use then both of those scenarios to formulate one trading plan. And this is where we get our personal biases and our predictions that we are going to be trading. OK, so I think I've been very clear uh, what my predictions have been publicly, but more so, of course, that you have to remember this is the biggest advantage, right, of being a champion member, that you get my more up-to-date, real-time, precise, clear biases. I've been making this very clear, right? I'm remaining bullish on Bitcoin. I'm expecting new yearly highs. I'm remaining in long all of my long trades. You know, I've been bullish on the stock market, been bullish on Coinbase, micro strategy, and, you know, for me, this has been fairly simple. This was the end of last year, reminding my team that I am remaining absolutely bullish. You know, I've been long in chill for a long time. That was the end of the year. And then we started to form this triangle, right? So with that triangle forming, really simply, we had this triangle. In the end, we got a drop to the triangle low, which was confluence with the weekly. We got a bounce off of the weekly and triangle low. We got a retest of the CC. So there's the bounce off the triangle low on the weekly retest of the CC locally on a 30 minute time frame. And this is, of course, for many people, an opportunity to open a new long with a very small invalidation. Why? Because you've got a bounce off the triangle low. You've got a bounce off the weekly. You've got a CC retest. This is an optimum time. You know, if you're looking for those day trades to get into those longs. And we can know from the last video that I made around 24 hours ago, we were trading up and around the middle of that triangle. OK, and then to the champion members, as we started to approach the top, I made it as clear as possible. I am remaining with the same bullish bias and predictions of new highs to come in January. To make it extremely clear, I am bullish on Bitcoin. I am expecting new highs above last year's high, and I am remaining in all of my long trades. So you hope you can understand that, you know, this is the massive confidence booster that many really need. And, you know, by making that bias very clear, by telling everybody clearly, I am expecting higher prices to come. That is why it pays to be a champion. Why? Because now everybody that followed along with that bias is sat in wonderful profits, happy with this rise that we have just seen and predicted would be coming. So you can just see here. Of course, people also trading along with the altcoins here on Tology. That's an old one. But I've also been bullish on altcoins over the past few months. I've been calling to my team some really nice altcoin setups, which, of course, are playing out very nicely. As you can see, champion members also very <laughs> happy with altcoin longs. And primarily, I want to be, of course, bring this back to Bitcoin. Whether you were trading, you know, this guy has saw a breakout, not long the breakout, but waited for a back test of the triangle. And then after that, back test SFP locally entered along and managed to capture there from 44.7 to 45.3. You can see a lot of people taking different trade styles, 
but at the end, all ending in very nice profits with those longs. So what I be want to be focusing on now is, of course, yesterday I was I was bringing attention to you of the potential fake out of this triangle. So I'll talk about that first, and then I'll talk about the targets that I have. So really simply, a fake out is very simply coming above a triangle or below, and then getting what looks like a legit breakout, then coming back into that triangle. And that is known as a fake out. Why? Because it looks like there is a legit breakout. Of course, the higher target for that breakout of the triangle is officially around here, $49,000, right? So if we are to come back into that triangle, that is a fake out. Why? Because you've got a break, you then did not hit target, come back into the triangle, that is then a fake out of the triangle. Okay, that's very important that you understand. What was really, really nice <laughs> is that there was no short at all to be had so far on the break of this, which was around, you know, 10, 11 p.m. UK time as the CME opened. The CME chart opened with a nice move to the upside, a little bit of a gap, and then continued strength for the rest of that hour. That what gave us this break. And for me as a trader, that's really nice because, of course, I'm interested in shorting a potential fake out of the first break of the triangle initially. And when price just does this, boom, straight through, no bearish reaction, no bearish order flow. It just it just lets me very simply say, well, I'm not taking a short here. Let's stay in long. Let's remain bullish. And that is why as we are coming up to that channel high, you can see here uh, 9.30 p.m. UK time. So you can go check all the timestamps as we're coming up to the highs. I'm just reminding my team and making it very clear and obvious. Bullish, bullish, bullish. Not looking you know, for the short here at the high. We got the nice breakout, which makes our job as traders very easy because there is no activation of any short trades and we simply continue looking for higher. Now, where we are right now is around a old, of course, now daily naked point of control. So we're finding a little bit of a resistance here. And ultimately, though, while we remain with the strength, we, of course, are going to be looking for higher prices. What you can see more locally is a pullback, OK, a little bit of a pullback. But there is no weakness on that, you know, pullback and to us and if we come back into the triangle. Why? Because remember, that is what activates the fake out. That would be very bearish. So if we come back into this triangle and we get acceptance back into here, that does activate a much more bearish scenario where we would be looking for the further drop to the downside because that would be a large fake out. Okay, it's very important that you understand that. That now, at the time of speaking and recording this video, we have not seen a fake out. Why? Because we are trading above that triangle. Thus, the highest probability is to continue on to higher price targets because there is no weakness. Again, very important that you understand this. As a trader, we have to trade the charts. You know, I can have my predictions, I can have my biases, but if there is something in the chart that tells me I am incorrect, I will then update my bias and trade based off the new information that I have. And I feel that that is one of the reasons that makes me so profitable as a trader is because I can analyze, you know, the order flow that I have in front of me and make an informed decision and, you know, have no ego when it comes to the charts. You know, the, the, the charts are always telling me the truth. I'm going to have to update my biases with the information that I have in front of me and that real time data. With the data that I have so far, I personally am looking for another move to the upside. That changes if we come back into the triangle where I would activate a more bearish plan. So for me, yes, I am looking for higher. So let me explain now what those higher targets for myself are. And of course, you can maybe use this along with yourself. Um, before that, I just want to say one very quick announcement. That is, of course, we do have the daily morning live stream updates. So you've already had a live stream from myself this morning. You've had another one on the stock market from Severin. And then you've got live trading with Igor later today. So we are back. We are already getting in those live streams three already. And uh, yeah, you got the live trading, of course, with Igor later today. And then 
every day jam packed with more updates, more live streams, getting you really just prepared for every single day of trading that comes. That is with the live stream daily updates. We got the update sheets giving you all the levels. Of course, we got the live trading where you can see all of this in the time, everything that you need right now to just absolutely crush it. Of course, the main focus of Chart Champions is not so much the uh, predictions that we're giving on the charts. It is the education. It is to educate you to learn how to do this yourself. And that is where you come into the courses section and as a contender and a champion, of course, but the contender is your starting place where you can come in here and learn all of the theory. OK, once you've really studied and understood the theory, that is where then you upgrade to champion to make use of the live trading and the updates, you know, because you, you would be uh, trading at that time. Right. So, yeah, that's what I wanted to say there. Finally, yeah, of course, I am doing these. Uh, I, know, I enjoy making it. So if you want to give a follow, go ahead and over on TikTok chart champions, I'm doing the more in real life content, um, also talking about trading facts about uh, myself, biggest trading mistakes that I see, how I spent a one, my first $1 million, those sort of like in real life videos. If you want to see more of that, you know where to get it, Chart Champions over on TikTok. Uh, back to the charts then. So as I mentioned, I am looking for higher. While we remain with that premise of being above the triangle, again, if we come back into this triangle, much more bearish. But while we are main, maintaining above this triangle, I am now looking for my major price target here around $47,000. This is my previous range point of control and an absolutely massive, crucial zone. I want to remind you that is a zone. But that is the next target that I'm looking for. This is my previous range point of control, you know, back from 21, 22. So a very, very big level. Uh, now a few years later in 2024, right? So massive, massive for me. If we do manage to claim that, that's where we'll be looking back up to around $48,000, which is our naked point of control. We would like to see a break of this ultimately though, cause the previous range value area high coming in there at 54. But we do have a major weekly prior to this. But for me, the, the biggest of these levels right now is the previous range point of control. If we get a rejection there, well, then you all know what I'm gonna be doing and it's shorting. Though, if we flip that, into support and continue this uptrend, well, that is very bullish indeed. This for me is a major level, a major zone, okay? And for me, pivotal for, for the year ahead. It truly is pivotal for the year ahead for myself. So yeah, I wanna just, you know, make you aware of that. Major levels that we have above us, the now local strength that we have, that if we get a back test, okay, is still fine. It's fine to get a back test of this. But if we get acceptance into the triangle, that's where this really activates the fake out and, you know, a much more bearish outlook, at least locally, right, for the bigger, bigger <laughs> drop, um, <laughs> which could end up in another buying opportunity. But nevertheless, bigger drop if we get acceptance into this triangle. So, you know, reminding you, if you want to see me and the other coaches every single day of the week, then that's where you can come in here and take advantage of the daily updates and our posts inside of Discord. This is where you'll get up to date biases and predictions from myself and the rest of the coaches uh, when we're, you know, when we're taking our trades. That's where always you'll get the updates first in the Discord. And, you know, you can see for yourself how it, it really can uh, pay to be a champion because if you are taking advantage of this information, well, you have actually followed along with my biases for the past few months. Uh, you are in absolutely wonderful long trades from much lower down in the charts. You can see here entries I've got around 36,000. Coinbase 137, of course, more locally, 41, 36, have others from 17,000. So, you know, this is just my long and short positions where I come in here and I tell the team every time, like, let's keep these trades open. Let's just go higher, higher, higher and higher. And when I get the weakness, of course, I have been taking some head shorts, but I'm not in any shorts right now out of them. And I am only in long trades. And uh, now you know where I am looking for next. And if we get the retracement for me, that's fine. And let's we get the acceptance of weakness, then I'll activate my bearish plan. If you want all of that information in real time, first, you will always get that as a champion member. But as I said, we do recommend you start off as a contender to educate yourself fully before you jump into the live trading. Cheers, everybody. Thank you. Hope you've enjoyed. Hope it's made sense. And I'll catch you over in the Discord and the website. Thank you and have a good one. Let's crush it and make a lot of profit. Cheers. Thank you. Goodbye.